Hi friends, we're going to do some body movements. We're going to be sitting in the chair the whole time and this is going to be good if you need to take a break in between sessions or something to start getting your brain moving in the morning before you start class. So we're going to start at the top of our body and then we're going to go all the way down and finish at the bottom. We'll just do about five or ten each. And our first exercise is just going to be looking up and then looking down. Try and put your chin down onto your chest and then stretch your neck up. Up and down. Just a few times. This is going to be nice and easy today. Okay, now we're going to do something similar, but we're going to go from side to side. Stretch your neck round. Maybe you slept funny. Maybe it's a bit tight from looking at the screen. Just go from left to right. You don't have to do it too hard. Make sure you're nice and comfortable. Okay, so we've done our neck and now we're going to move to our shoulders. So we're going to start with some shoulder shrugs. So just roll them in tiny or even big if you can circles just around the shoulder. Roll them forward. And when you've done five or 10, roll them backwards. Move those shoulders backwards. Okay, we've done our shoulders. Next, we're gonna go down to our elbows. We're gonna put our arms together like this. And we're just gonna reach up one at a time. Maybe we can count to 10, nine, eight. Try and stretch all the way up, seven, Six, five, four, feel that stretch all the way down here. Three, two, one. Okay, now we've done our elbows, we're gonna do our wrists next. So we're gonna put our hands out and we're just gonna do some wrist circles round and around. Maybe you've been typing a lot today. Spin them around and then Twist them the other way. Twist those fingers. You can do it out wide if you want. You can do it up high. You can do it in front. Just twist those fingers. Okay, now we've done our wrists. We're gonna do our whole arms. So we're just gonna reach back as far as we can. You should feel a stretch all across your chest here. And then we're gonna bring our arms back around and squeeze our body as hard as we can. Reach back and then bring them in, squeeze your body. Reach back, in for the squeeze, one more time. Reach back and in for the squeeze. Okay, shake it off and we're gonna do our sides now. So let's just reach over to the side in our chair. Make sure you don't fall off. And stretch out your side. Lean over with your arm. Reach to the side. Wow, okay. Shake off that upper body. And now we're gonna move to the lower. Oops, I forgot an exercise. I'll add it in after. We're gonna cross our leg over and lean forward. And we're gonna cross it onto the other side and lean forward. If you wanna pick it up and then lean forward you can. Put it down, put it across the other leg. You can put it across like this if you want or you can put it across like that, it doesn't matter. Let's just twist it over and lean forward and touch the floor. Ooh, I can't touch the floor, I can just about touch my toes though. Reach as far down your leg as you can. Three, two, one. Okay, we're still in our chair and our next exercise is gonna be a knee squeeze. So, let's bring our leg up, grab it with our arms, and give it a big squeeze. Every time we put it down, we swap to the other leg. If you have a back on your chair, you can lean back, straighten your back out, and pull that leg in. Give it a big squeeze. Let's do it about 10 times. So five times each knee, pull it in, 
And there we go. Our next exercise is going to be for our toes. It's going to be a big toe tap. So let's tap those toes. Pick up our toes, bend them towards your leg, and give them a tap. Can you make a song? Can you make a little tune? Tap those toes. Do about 10 on each toe. And when you're finished, give your legs a little shake out. Pick them up off the floor. Shake them everywhere. Wiggle your legs. And wiggle your arms too. Wiggle the legs. Wiggle the arms. Give yourself a shake. And you're ready to go back to work.